Park Route 66 is popular on its own, but there's a new push for a different attraction to draw in visitors. News 13's Rebecca Atkins has more from the Newsplex. Well, Kim, the musical highway was added along the historic route to add some flair. Now a new group is looking to add something else, a license plate wall. The group behind it tells me this is just one of many things to come that will draw many people to the area. Route 66, traveled by many as one of the first highways in the U.S. This is a main thoroughfare for visitors in New Mexico. Roger Holden is the president of Relive the Route, also known as Retro 66, a group of volunteers with a mission to revitalize the historic road, an idea conceived by Senator Sue Wilson Beffert. We wanted to do some economic development in the East Mountains, and how can we best do that other than capture the essence and the history and the uh, uh, of Route 66. Just like National Geographic did with its musical highway. It's drawn a lot of traffic. Now the Retro 66 crew has another idea to bring in travelers. We're putting a wall up here of license plates. In the background will be the yellow New Mexican license plates, 960 of them. 66 of them will be turquoise outlining the route through New Mexico. Holden made a video of what it will look like. So we're here at Highway 217. It will stand on this historic property, a former gas station built in the 40s and once watched over by this man. Bob Ludette is known as the guardian of the route. He died in 2012. They want the wall here in his honor. The New Mexico State license plate, if you look at it, there's one that says 66 on it. That was his design. Down the road, the group is also planning on turning this lot into a drive-in movie theater. They also want to turn this old gas station into a museum and bring back the old gas pumps. To make this an attraction, a place to stop, a place to enjoy Route 66. Now there's only a drive-in theater in the state that's in Carlsbad. The plan also includes enough money to put in a camera so you can push a button and it'll snap your picture while you visit the wall. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks Rebecca. Now the plates were donated by the DMV. They can be purchased for different costs and specialty plates can also be made as well.